so so hey guys today we are back for another video and today I will be showing you how to make a proper base so all you're gonna need is some sand you're gonna need some sand you're gonna need some sand you're gonna need lots of wood and you're gonna be needing lots of cobblestone you know we made a cobblestone generator last video and i will put a link into that in the description and you can go check that out and so let's get into it so first chop down all your trees so uh, so you get lots of wood so lots of wood is important because um, it's also used for the because it's used for the base. It's also used for some decorations too. And so, once you've got lots of wood, um, you can go to your nearby river if you do have one. And then scoop a bunch of sand. So much sand. You're gonna need a lot of sand. For this well, not way really too much, but still gonna need. So, once you've got your sand, so, once you've got your sand, then you're going to want to smelt the sand in a furnace. And then you're going to put all that sand in your furnaces to cook. And then, while you are doing that, you're gonna want to get your cobblestone. So let's head over to our cobblestone generator. Insert mine. So, um, let's pretend that I mined a lot. Pretend that I mined a bunch of cobblestone, and then we're ready to start. So, first you're gonna be digging out a base for your floor. The floor, you're gonna be digging out the floor, and so we're gonna make this special. Well, we're gonna make it look nice by putting like either cobblestone or um, wooden planks. Um, it's really just your choice, but um, uh, like you can do that if you want. Um, you can leave it as a dirt floor, but it's nice to put it like this. Yeah, and make them like four blocks tall with these logs, and you can craft the rest of the oak planks. Then, what you're gonna want to do fill in all this with the planks. I think I'm gonna need a little more so I'm gonna slash give me some more. So planks bunch of these is already looking pretty nice don't you say and then you're gonna want to place down some of your cobblestone on the outer rim and this is gonna be one of the spots it's gonna be like one of those things and then since all of your glass has smelted you can go and collect all that And then you're gonna want to craft a lot of that into glass panes, as you can see I got back. And then you're gonna want to head back, and you're gonna want to do this. And then 
you can place your glass painting to the middle. You also want to leave a two block space. And this build involves like the teeniest two pressure plates and two doors. And it's a very small amount of redstone. And it's very good for new players that don't know redstone. You know, complicated redstone. I bet I bet you've heard of it. Make like redstone computers and stuff. And so, not to sort of topic, uh, you can keep placing this, all these oak planks, and you can cut some glass panes. And then, once you are done with that, which I will be in a second, uh, you can start making some doors. Some doors? And also some pressure plates are gonna be needed. So to make those, you are going to wanna, um, for the doors, you do that, and then it gives you doors. Then for the pressure plates, you, you wanna do that. For the pressure plates. So the pressure plates are important. Well, they're nice. So that you can like, once you enter, it automatically closes the door, and once you're going out, it automatically opens the door. So, I'm gonna show you this. Bam, automatically closed, automatically open. So, that is nice. And then you're gonna wanna get back and then turn the rest of your wood into uh, this stairs. And I want a bunch of stairs. So, uh, I'm gonna give myself some oops, stairs. I'm gonna give myself a lot of those. Yeah, a lot are needed. And what you what you really just want to do is you wanna put your roof or whatever block you want, and then you're gonna start putting stairs on top for it to be the roof shingles basically and then it's gonna look really nice and you can even add like a, a scary basement no a, a scary attic an attic so I'm gonna need a little more cobblestone so I can finish Oof, don't want to make it too high. That doesn't really, that isn't really good. So, then, once you're done with that, you're gonna want to get to the top of the roof in some way. Like, by pillaring up there. Um, some players don't know how to, how to do this, but you just jump in place beneath you. And if you do that at the right timing, um... Then you can do that, and then we're up to the roof. And then what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna do this with the stairs. And don't worry about corners, they just correct automatically with the stair thing. And you can basically, you're basically gonna wanna like, so, so I'm gonna, finish this so it's easier to explain um so you basically just repeat and keep doing this you can also make a little hole then you can put like a ladder up there and then like like a ladder up here and here would be where the attic would be but if you don't want a attic then you can just keep placing this and keep placing like that and then maybe we yeah, until until it gets to the top and there's no more space for the stairs anymore and then well your house is going to be completely finished and then you can also get some torches you know like a place if it needs a little more light and you can 
goofy or messed up for Mouth of Ace One, which should look like something like this. And then you would have your house. So, bye guys. See you in the next video.